Oh, you can talk about it. Um, <coughs> depending on the time, if you take a break, breaks are useful. Um, it can be useful to ask people not to talk to each other during the break if mm -hmm. you think that that will just build tension, just as like a tool. And, Go ahead. And, can I, and, and what I found in terms of having not people not talk to each other is that you might get really be getting deep. You might be having some really deep emotional stuff come up. I'm getting like kind of down here. And also you take a break and you're up here and things are easy again. Um, and you might get into a superficial moment. Small talk, chat. Um, and it can be something that we call as you start to create false community. You don't <laughs> want to actually deal with the work of creating real community, which is dealing with this hard stuff. So at times, it can actually make it harder to get back into that deeper space where you're like, oh, we don't really need to deal with these big deal issues because we can easily talk about the weather. <laughs> right? And so that can be one reason why you might not want to talk, and that might make sense for your group, depending on the situation. So I, again, this is, depends on the, how tense the conflict is, but <coughs> you can do these in go-arounds where you're addressing each step one at a time. That's what this map kind of models. So the next piece is what do you need or want. That can be conversational. It can be one-on-one, -on -one, one person monologuing at a time <coughs> to the group. It can be one person conversing with you. Let's say the tenser it is, the more helpful I find for one person to not monologue at me, but to have a dialogue with me, to converse with me. Because they don't actually know what it is exactly. They're not sure what's going on, they don't know yet. And I can sometimes just talk to them, help them figure it out. Sometimes in that process, you might identify goals for the whole group, or you might not. Um, and then we do the what are you going to do about it? At the end, there can, there can be next steps. We're going to write a report and bring it back to the co-op. We're going to say, coming out of this, this group is mandating that we develop policies around these things. This group really, versus like, this group really wants to talk about this in the bigger group. You know, it can be whatever, however your co-op is um, set up your process around mediations. And also, whatever that group needs. Yeah? Um, I'm not sure if this is appropriate, but